Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I am filming a plan with me for November 1st through November 7th and I'm not sure where the uh, original footage is of me starting this plan with me so this is all I could find from the beginning but I am using the fall football kit from Scribble Prints Co and I am using underlays from Planta Hannah that are still available in her shop. I am a PR person for Planta Hannah. You can use Angelia 15 for 15% 15 off or put Angelia in the notes to get my freebie and Black Friday is coming up. So definitely check out what she has for Black Friday. Um, a lot of new things and some extra freebies. And also, you can put my name in the notes and get another freebie. And the underlays, um, the footballs are in rose gold, and then their playbook pattern is in green. And I pulled in this green Simply Gilded Washi. And I think part of the reason why the footage was lost from the very beginning is because I actually started putting the, the glitter headers down on the week after this. So... I had to take all of the glitter headers off and put them on this week. So that was my planning fail. I haven't had a planning fail in a while, but you know, you have to have one every once in a while. And um, I'm not sure if it is on camera or not, but I did add deco to the top. And I think that is it. I'm also using some overlays from Planta Hannah just the I think it's just the fall I think it's just called fall um on a couple days in rose gold as well and I am really happy with the rose gold with this kit it looks really great and I did have to do a day extender for Wednesday as you can see so getting started on the day by day on Monday I just marked day off with a script from Planta Hannah and a washi strip then I marked that I had a YouTube binge that day. Both of those stickers are from Planta Hannah. And then I marked that I just did some cleaning a lot of the day. So I have this script sticker that says clean all of the things. And a little spray bottle from Carly Plans. Then I marked that I got some Happy Mail after. And some TV time. Um, probably Hulu stuff. I'm, I'm imagining um, there's probably some shows on Hulu. And then that night I watched Afterlife of the Party. It was a Netflix movie and it was actually a really good Netflix movie. And I actually cried at the end. Um, and if you follow me on Instagram, I shared on my Instagram and asked if I was the only one that cried during that movie because I was like, okay, is this movie really sad? Like, did it make other people cry or was it just me crying because I was emotional? So I was just really curious to know that. And then on Tuesday, I just marked that I had another YouTube binge. I was kind of taking the week off of reading a little bit because I read so many books in October and just did way too much reading in October. So I was taking a little break and I'm definitely slowing down my reading for November for sure. And then I marked that I did some more cleaning and then I marked with this organized sticker and um, shoe sticker from Carly Plans that I organized the shoe closet. I just put the organized sticker down and then put shoe closet underneath. And then I put that I did an Instagram post and uploaded a video to YouTube. And then I went to work. And for dinner that night, we had some hot dogs and fries. I got the fries that are kind of like Chick-fil-A fries. I got waffle fries from Sam's Club, so we had those a good bit. And then I just marked that I watched some Hulu and had a lazy night that night. Hulu stickers from Carly Plans and lazy night um, character sticker is from Stick With The Plan Co. Then on Wednesday, we went and visited my daughter's school, so I, I marked that first thing in the morning, and the school sticker is from Once More With Love. 
just did a little visit so she could visit her teacher and walk around and see what it was like so she wouldn't be scared the first day of school. And she got to play in both of the gyms that they have. Her school is really great, has really great indoor gyms. One is like fully padded with foam and she can have a lot of fun in that. And then the other gym ha is pretty big. It has like a rock climbing wall and basketball hoops and slides and all kinds of things. So it's really great for Minnesota winters whenever it is too cold to get outside. She can play in those gyms. And I, since I do have a day extender, I am planning here from the bottom up is just like how I, how I like to do it whenever I have a day extender, but I will tell you what I did in order, obviously. So then next I marked folding clothes and that clothes hamper sticker is from Beneva Creations. Then I marked that I did some more cleaning. And then I've just been writing YouTube stuff for days that I do like multiple things for YouTube, like editing, uploading, filming, voiceovers, you know, all that stuff. If I do more than one thing, then I just write YouTube stuff. And I actually got a custom from Plana Hannah just that just says YouTube stuff. So I put that in a camera from Carly Plans and then we went to Target in the library. And then I made tortellini soup for dinner that night. That was very good. I really, really liked it. Unfortunately, I don't think I put enough broth in there. Like it was good as soup the first night we had it, but then the next day it like soaked up all of the broth. So it was more like a pasta, but that's fine. It was like two meals in, in one. So yeah, I made that homemade tortellini soup and definitely want to make it again soon. And then that night I marked that we watched Lock and Key on Netflix. And I think that might've been the last, no, that wasn't the last episode. All right. And then on Thursday I had parent teacher conferences for my son and I marked that there was no school. I went to Aldi after that uh, paper bag grocery sticker is from Paper and Milk. Went to work and I put together, I marked that I put together my secret Santa gift that I had to send the next day. Um, I participated in a booktube secret Santa where we sent everybody our wish lists and then we got paired up with somebody and um, got our gifts sent to us. We haven't opened the gifts yet. We're actually going to open them over a Zoom party, but I wanted to get it sent so that my person would have it in time. And then I marked that I uploaded a YouTube video and I have at the bottom of the day this sleepy emoji from Planahanna and a tired as F script from Planahanna as well. On Friday, I marked another new no school day and then I layered some stickers from the YouTube sticker is from Mr. and Mrs. Mint and then the camera foiled icon is from Rose Colored Days to mark some more YouTube stuff. Then I used this bubble sticker from Carly Plans to mark that I took the kids to play outside and then I went to the post office afterwards and after that, went to work. After work, I went to Walmart, and then unfortunately, I had a migraine on Friday night. I have been getting a migraine at least once a week, so that has not been fun. But the migraine character sticker is from Beneva Creations. On Saturday, I marked that I cleaned the house and did some reading. And then we watched Lock and Key, had McDonald's for dinner. And unfortunately, um, my daughter, she got something in her eye. It was like a piece of a leaf. And we tried to get it out by like flushing her eye out and it didn't work. So unfortunately that night we had to take her to the ER 
because they had to actually help us with her. So that was not fun. Uh, we took her to urgent care first and urgent care said, nope, they cannot help us. You need to take her to the ER. And since we already tried what we could had to do or tried everything that we could do at home, then, you know, that was our next option. So yeah, we had to take her to the ER that night. And then I just marked that once we got home, I just did some reading before bed. Then Saturday, I obviously was very tired. So I have the tired as F script from Planahanna and the tired mom um, sticker from Once More With Love. Then I had a YouTube binge that day, did some reading, and then I really, really cleaned the car like deep clean detailed it like vacuumed it cleaned it cleaned all the trash vacuumed it wiped down all the inside um really washed down the mats so i really detailed the car that day so i wanted to mark that in my planner and then i believe that might have been the last of us watching lock and key so we finished up lock and key that night or that during the day and then I took a nap since I was really really tired did some cleaning after and then I marked Aunt Flo with a sticker from Carly Plants and a script from Planet Hannah and then since our weekend was a little bit crazy with the ER and I worked I work a lot on Fridays um, we kind of forgot that my son was starting to have homework and so we had to do a last minute Sunday night homework with him. So I marked that. And honestly, like, I'm trying to get good at, you know, doing my kids homework right away, but it is hard. And it's hard. I don't know why a first grader has to have homework every single night, but it it is what it is. And... Uh, me and my fiance are trying to take turns with doing homework with him, but yeah, let me just say that that is really hard and I learned my lesson to really try not to wait until Sunday night to do homework with him. So hopefully I will continue to not do that, but we are still getting used to doing homework every night around here. And that is my completed spread with this kit, I am really in love with the rose gold with it. Happy that I went out of my comfort zone and pulled in that little bit of green in the background. Um, if you don't know, I don't really use fun foil colors, but I am trying to get out of my comfort zone and use them more. So you might see them. I don't know about, you know, too much more this year, but I definitely want to step out of my comfort zone and use some more foiled colors next year. Um, but also for Christmas, I think I have some red and green uh, header overlays, so might pull in some red and green for Christmas. But it's just really hard for me to not use just the core foil colors, so... But I am really happy that I used the green and it looks great with that playbook pattern. And I love the washi with it as well. Here is my finish spread and what I have left over. This was an ultimate kit, so I have a good bit of stuff left over, I would say. Um, this is, I am now doing like a mix of mini kits and ultimate kits to kind of save some money but this was the last of me buying ultimate kits all the time and here is the foil in action thank you so much for watching this plan with me definitely like and subscribe if you like this kind of content and have a great day or night whenever you are watching this thank you and bye